Yay! Yay! <laughs> if you joined me for my Bright Kitchen Pantry organization video, you know that I said I was going to follow it up with a self-service video for kids. Here are a few specific ways to make your pantry more kid-friendly, and it makes it easier on you. Fingers crossed that my pantry takeover does not require two part parts. Here goes, I have a kiddo sleeping and another one doing an activity at my feet. So we will see how many snack breaks are requested and how many littles help me during the course of hours of putting this pantry back together. Now can will, we please play? Stay tuned. Now can we please play? Yeah. Let's start with something fun, shall we? Consider non-traditional items that make it into your pantry and decide whether it makes sense to leave them. In our pantry, I decided to store our Play-Doh, Play-Doh trucks, Play-Doh toys of all kinds. Then I made labels for this bin with bright turquoise glitter tape. I used two different fonts, which made it even more fun for me. Play-Doh foam slime goes in the top one. Then we have Maker's Things, all kinds of tools. Then we have Play Kitchen Things. That one seemed to be a good fit for the pantry. You may have seen my recent video on pantry organization using Dollar Tree products. I encourage you to consider using these dollar products because you can get so much for your dollar. <laughs> and they are oftentimes BPA free, so you just wanna check the label to be sure. Totally self-service for the kiddos. Can we just talk about the convenience here for a second? <laughs> I love you too. So many times. Love you, love you, love you. Allow me to show you a few of my faves. So for food safe containers, we of course have these clear ones with the purple lids. And then if you want a larger size or a different style, there are the silver lids with the clear oval shapes, and those come in two different sizes. Snacks are ready to go. Stock up with the items that you know your kiddos are going to want to access quite frequently. So whether this is your first time joining me or you are a return guest, I'm so glad that you're here and perhaps you'll be able to join me for some experiments and imperfection as well. I sure hope you stick around my life space and examine these moments with me. There's always a lot to learn and hopefully a lot of fun along the way. Hey, learning and fun, that's two of my core values. So I would say you can definitely plan to expect lots more where that came from. Don't forget other fun options like the food trays. I thought those would be a really fun item to take out on the deck when the kids are ready for lunch outside. The sun is still won't get a scent from me. I mix the fit up with the salad, like it's a remedy. I mix it up inside the pot, watch it drip while it drop, drop. Time to take it to the top. Chips all in the middle, like it fall. No, I won't flop. We gon' pop, pop, like a soda can top. To me, this is nothing to call my bluff, and I won't stop when I flex. I don't want no combo, I want chess. I don't want the second, I want best. By any means, that's a triple threat. Just for kicks, I decided to add my banner. I don't want the second, I want best. I'm all in my ass, I'm a 
You can find this and other fluid art projects here on my channel. I'm so grateful for these installed can racks and the spice rack around the corner. So I simply grouped like items together and if any of the kids want to help get things off of the shelves, they can just use the small step stool. When it comes to the spices, I had a blast organizing them. I loved transferring the contents ever so carefully with the funnel that came with the set and I loved being able to choose which labels I was going to put on the front or on the top. When you look straight on, seeing all those labels lined up and it's just, it's right up my alley. These, you want these please? Oh, I was just going to put them away. I was just going to put them away again. You're always taking them. <laughs> She's obsessed. You got your Play-Doh? Okay. That will be fun. going? <laughs> Do you like to get snacks? You do? Yeah. What if I put that one back? Ooh, is there a good one clear down on the bottom? Oh, you found one of the other ones, didn't you? Snackaholic. Okay. <laughs> Do you like everything organized? Does it look good? Oh, baby shark. Oh, baby shark. Oh, baby shark is better than my pantry? Oh, baby shark. Okay, baby shark it is. <laughs> I'm so excited. We are going to cover quite a few things. I'm all about my experiments in imperfection. Some of these things are going to be things you have tried, like sprucing up your home. This is not new. People do it all the time. Some people do it seasonally. And I think that the big and the small things, whether you've done them before, make all the difference. Some things are going to be hard. Life is hard. Right? But let's make lemonade. Oh yes, and let's be better humans. <laughs> These are my experiments. Whoa. <laughs> These are my experiments in imperfection. Time for a series called Drab to Less Drab. Less Drab. A little something I came up with. Instead of drab to fab, I'm hashtag embracing imperfections. So this just seemed perfect for my new series. I began recording in March and I have dozens of videos prepared for you. As of this recording, it has been exactly three months since my perfectly imperfect departure from everyday life began. <laughs> Now this pause has really been more of a reset for me. I spent some time in the doldrums, I will admit, but I've emerged with a fresh perspective and a new lease on life. Oh, this would be fun for all of us. I have videos drafted, I've hired a video editor to help me, take ads, have new equipment coming. I'm all in, baby. Hi, mommy. Hi, honey. I actually think raising those hooks helps with the appearance. Yeah, looks good. <laughs> hey, you. Do you see the lights? <laughs> Is that pretty? It's plant food in here. Coming up, we are going to have DIYs, self-care routine, health and fitness videos, and speaking of a refresh, I've refreshed every space inside and out around my place. Could you melt my heart by giving me a thumbs up on this video? Okay. Because it tastes really, really good. Thank you. Are you doing a video? I am. Okay. <laughs> so you can picture, so you can have that in the video and yep. we talk about it. That's right. <laughs> PPS. Here is a preview of an upcoming video. Highly recommend. Highly recommend. Hashtag meal prep goals. Highly recommend. Highly make a rent. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
<laughs> you said it wrong, so it's funny. <laughs> I did it right. I did it right. I did it right. I did it right.